Hey guys, I'd like to introduce my 84 Toyota pickup that I've been building up since 2015. And specifically, I wanted to talk about the tires. They're Kanadi Mugatog MTs. And I couldn't find many reviews on them. I couldn't find any bad reviews on them either. So I just thought I would do a little review video and give you guys my thoughts. Um, tell you what I like about them and what I don't really like about them. Um, I've had them since December 2019 and I've taken them on some snow wheeling, a lot of daily driving on and off depending on how I feel, and two Rubicon trips. Matter of fact, they're trail fresh. Just got off the Rubicon yesterday. so. You can see what they look like right after that. Um, start with the good things I like about them. They're smooth on the street. Uh, I didn't balance them. I just put them on some 17 inch steel wheels and I can take them up to 65 or so and don't seem to have any problem. Uh, I don't really go on the highway too much with them. So yeah, anyway. Without being balanced, they're pretty smooth. Uh, they're also really soft. As a matter of fact, they'll even flat spot just a little bit uh, sitting overnight. And I personally like that they're soft because that means when I'm rock crawling, they grip the rocks really well. See, I'm not really pushing too hard there. They got quite a bit of squish to them. Um, so yeah, I like that they're soft. I like their size selection. Um, they have 37s, which is what these are. Even up to 39 inch tires. I guess if you want to run 40 inch and bigger, that's probably not the tire for you. Um, they have 37 and 39 inch for 17 inch wheels. They seem pretty tough, and um, I'll show you over here. I kind of washed this one off earlier so we can take a look at it closer. You can see uh, my wheel here took quite a bit of rock rash, but you know, it's a rock crawler, that's what it's for. Um, let's see, you can see a bunch of little marks from the rocks. They're kind of on the side wall there, but it doesn't seem like there's any issues. I don't have any big chunks missing out of it or anything. So that's nice. Um, looks. I like the way they look. I know that's just aesthetic as far as doesn't make it perform any better, but hey, I like my trucks to kind of look a certain way. Uh, disregard that beast. That's something else. Um, and so, yeah, I like the look of this tire. Uh, it's reminiscent of the old school MTR, which they don't make anymore. I never ran those. But... And a lot of people liked them, so the tread design must be decent. The sidewall tread kind of reminiscent of the newer MTR, so to me it seems like it's kind of a kind of a mix of MTR looks, new and old. Um, the company that makes them is by Greenball, I guess, which is they make a lot of UTV tires. And like I said earlier, can't find any bad reviews on them, so that's all I can tell you about them other than it seems like they make some good tires for UTVs, so I thought I would give them a shot because I'm not made of money and I think this set of 37s cost me somewhere in the $800 range and I kind of wanted to try something a little different. You know, a lot of rock crawler guys run 
MTRs and IROX. Had a set of IROX too, but I want to try these. So, a um, couple things that might not be so good is the the softness that I like would probably be a bad thing on a larger vehicle. Uh, let's see, you can see here quite a bit of chunking going on. Uh, not too bad, but a little bit. I don't think this would probably fare very well under a heavy truck, especially a diesel or something. I don't think I would recommend it. Not that I'm an expert on the subject, but I'll tell you, soft tires don't last that long on a big truck, so. Um, and I don't mind the chunking. Uh, I'll take a soft tire with some chunking as long as it has the performance I'm looking for. And like I say, I just came back from the Rubicon. Uh, we had a blast. I tires did everything I wanted to do, so I got no complaints there. Uh, but one thing I don't really like is the width. Uh, the 37 and the 39 only come in a 12 and a half inch width and while I realize that's a preference thing I personally would like a little bit wider tire 13 14 inches maybe partially for looks partially because I feel like it keeps you out of holes and can drive over stuff instead of into it a little easier so Anyway, that's my thoughts on these Kanadi Mud Hogs. Uh, I think overall they're a great tire. Uh, you know, I haven't had them a super long time, a little less than a year, but put them to the test and I've been happy with them. So, uh, if you ever want to see a little walk around video on the Toyota, you can put that in the comments. Um, if you have any questions about the tires, you can put that in the comments. And uh, thanks for watching. Have a good day.